Hi, I'm Jonathan Romano, owner of Cascadia Northwest and Realty One Group. I'd like to welcome you to our services and hope to meet with you in person soon and show you how our real estate investors are using some of the tools that we give out for free to boost their 1031 exchange, immediately impacting the return on investment, whether it's a rental property, residential or commercial, in any marketplace, good or bad, with no extra cash down, no extra time, no extra stress, and without raising the rents. If I've learned anything working with real estate investors over the past 15 years, it would be this. That even though you may have two of these same real estate investors buying very similar pieces of property, one is per way overperforming the other. The one that lags behind, we find, either uses very little of the 1031 exchange tools or even zero. Another thing that we're going to go over when we meet would be uh, the assets. If you have any assets, what makes the most sense with those assets? Right now, we also do a pinpoint price so we can give you an exact number of what we think those things would be worth. Um, and, uh, and then if you were, let's say, on the flip side of things, not necessarily looking to uh, liquidate, but you may be looking to potentially purchase, we have a list of literally hundreds of homes that are not currently being advertised or marketed. So that allows you, our investor, to buy a property with little to zero competition, which allows you to get it for the best deal. And maybe 1031 Exchange, with all of our tweaks and all the different ways we use it, maybe it's not for you. Like one of our recent investors called me up two weeks ago and said, hey, Jonathan, um, I think I'm gonna liquidate. Now this investor has over 25 properties. Did he get it all overnight? Absolutely not. Did he get it using 1031 Exchange? Yes, he did. And so now he's created such an incredible amount of wealth and uh, for 90% of real estate companies or teams, um, they hear 25 homes, they're like, oh my goodness, this is gonna be a full-time job for everybody. But our team actually is um, used to handling big projects. So we've had builders um, where we've sold over 300 homes for them. Um, and then also quite a few other 1031 um, exchange um, uh, investors. So we can handle any type, whether it's one home or whether it's 50 homes or 150 homes. Um, we've done that many times and we know how to handle that. One of the things that we're gonna do is we're gonna look at the assets. We're gonna go through them one by one, put a strategy together that maximizes the sale for those properties. And be careful because we've had many investors go into their properties and spend all this money to fix it up and think that they're gonna get all this money back out of it. But they've actually overspent they spent $10,000 to get it what they thought made it ready to sell. And what ended up happening is when we went over there, they didn't need to spend the $10,000 at all. They could have kept that money and it would have sold for the same amount. So um, it's always important to reach out to us first. That's part of one of the things that we love to, that we will go over in our appointment. Um, the other thing is, um, let's say you, uh, we walk through your house. Now, sometimes we're gonna say, Everything looks great, keep it the way it is. But if we recommend something, that's something we recommend. If it costs $5,000, I'm not gonna recommend that unless we can get 10 or 15 or $20,000 of equity out of that. So we're always thinking about how do we maximize? How do we sell it in the best time frame and maximize it? This is one of the other things as well. Don't kick your renter out before you meet with us. Those renters, oftentimes, depending on the asset, the home can be worth more to other investors um, if there's a rental, uh, a renter currently occupying it. So keep that in mind. Um, and there's many different little strategies that we're going to go over in our appointment that will really help you maximize your 1031 exchange and keep the process going. So one of my favorite strategies after you buy a piece of property 
Now, great, you have a real estate piece of property. You have a, 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 an investment. Now, how do you start getting money out of that investment? You gotta rent it. That renting strategy, no one does what we do. We can fill that rent, uh, or fill that unit or multiple units in a matter of two to three hours with the best, highest paying renter um, and someone that gives us a long-term commitment if we want it. And the other thing about these uh, renters that we go after is we go after renters that could potentially even buy your unit later on down the road. And that's one of the things that we wanna talk about when we meet and we can go into deep, uh, some deep conversations on going on uh, with strategy on that. But the rental piece is so important because that's your income. That's your monthly, that's how you're making, uh, you know, uh, uh, maybe uh, that's what you're living off of. So making sure that those are rented with good tenants because they're virtually the ones that are taking care of your real estate asset. Um, the other thing that, we're, that we do is, uh, I'm pretty sure this is unique to us, is we pay for your 1031 exchange costs. So you're not gonna have to worry about anything along those lines. Um, our goal through all of this is to ultimately maximize your investments through 1031 exchange strategies with you doing little to zero of the heavy lifting. So we do everything. All you do is say, hey, you guys are it. We have, we'll, we will address, we'll find new uh, properties um, and we'll go over all of that in the appointment. So click on the link below and I look forward to meeting you in person. If there's anything you guys need, please don't hesitate to reach out to us. Take care.